Hi, David Jennings here from MelbourneSEOServices.com with a video on the way that we submit press releases using PRWeb.com. So I've just logged into my account and the first thing that I've done for this particular release, I selected the highest option they have. I think it was about 360 bucks. The reason we did that is because we've got a video that we wanted to embed into the release as you can see down here. Now I've already gone ahead and pre-populated everything so I'll just talk you through uh, what we're going for here. Um, firstly we've got our headline, our summary, our body content, our video here, uh, we've got a snapshot taken from the video and then we've also got a little box here um, which is a comment. So I'll just talk you through. So the first one, headline. Now it's a good idea um, to approach this in the same way that you would do normal keyword research and optimization uh, based on the keywords that you're going after. Now um, the keyword that we're looking for here, uh, and I haven't actually done the uh, optimization for this just yet because I wanted to save it for the video, but um, we've written the press release and then we'll try and work the keyword in after. Now, when it comes to press releases, the uh, SEO component really needs to go secondary to the media actually enjoying it and reading it and having it read well for a human as opposed to trying to get it right for the search engines and we try and work the keyword in. Now up the top here we've got the ability to customize the URL. Now what I'm going for, I've gone for Old Spice Parody Commercial. Now I might even change that slightly because I did some keyword research and noticed that Old Spice Commercial um, was a good keyword. Now, I'm, uh, so I'll keep that together, and then we'll add the word parody. So we'll just hit save. Now, I'm not 100% sure if I've got it open here. Maybe we'll have a look at the yes Google keyword search, and we'll just drag that a little closer. Uh, so you can see here we've got Old Spice commercials and Old Spice commercial. Um, now that's obviously going to be a good mix. There's also new. Old Spice commercial that might be quite good because it's um, even though it's got less searches it'll be reasonably well targeted um, and might be a good fit for us so um, because this is sort of uh, writing off that that goodwill of Old Spice so I'll go new Old Spice commercial parody so our keyword being new Old Spice commercial now I've got here the headline Smart social media advertising breathes new life into Old Spice um, commercial. Now I'm just going to add the word commercial in there because I don't think it throws it off too much uh, and then that way we can have the word at least Old Spice in the title there. Now we've got summary here which is just something that hopefully can hook the person if they just read the summary. Old Spice became the number one all-time most viewed branded channel on YouTube 12 months uh, on and the company is still milking this successful campaign. As you could expect from the viral video, uh, the, the viral video has caused a chain reaction of par parodies all over the world, and now a new breed of company, uh, now a new breed of com, now new breed, now, now a new breed of company, um, company jumps on board. Now, if we can get it in there, which is. Uh, Old new Old Spice commercial. Let's see if we can do it. Uh, as you can see, all around the world, uh, now a new jumps on board with a new Old Spice commercial parody. New now, new now. Now other now other companies jump on board with their Old Spice commercial parodies. As could be expected, the viral videos caused a chain reaction of parodies all over the world, and now other companies jump on board with their own spin on things. I'm just thinking, it's kind of, I don't want to throw it off. As could be expected, the viral video has created a chain reaction of, of parodies of um, Old Spice 
commercial parodies. As could be expected, the viral video has created a chain reaction of Old Spice commercial parodies all over the world. Old Spice commercial parodies all over the world. And now... And now... And now other companies jump on board. The gravy... Train. Okay, let's see how that reads. As could be expected, the viral video has caused a chain reaction of Old Spice commercial parodies all over the world, and now other companies jump on board the gravy train. Alright, so I'm just going to hit save. Now that can be our summary. Then we move into the actual thing here. Now if we can work in our keyword, so new Old Spice commercial is what we want. Uh, there is no denying blah 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 blah. Um, moving into here, as could be expected, um, life imitates art, and subsequently, the spot has caused a chain reaction of new old spice commercial spice commercial parodies all over the world. Um, Campaigns like Old Spice, blah, 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 blah. Yep. Okay. If we're going to get it in, I think it needs to be somewhere in here. On Old Spice. On the Old Spices. No. Commercials success plays on the Old Spice commercials success. Okay, so we've squeezed it in a couple of times there. So that's pretty much how you do it. Just like you would normally optimize a normal article, try and put it in your URL, put it in your headline, put it in your description, put it in your article body. One other thing you'll notice down here is on the highest level, I've been given the ability to link deeply to a few pages. So um, we've got here what do they say? Remember to check your own press release uh, and make sure that your company... We recommend the number of links series one per 100 words. So we might actually do a quick word count on this as well just to see how many words we should have. Tools, word count and words. We've got 500 so and I've loaded in one, two, three, four. So that should be fine. Uh, now I've deeped, uh, linked deep to the page that's specific to the video parody. Uh, then I've also got through to our home page. We're trying to rank for SEO services now that we rank for Melbourne SEO services. So I've, uh, we want to actually want to go for SEO Melbourne, but um, I didn't want to disrupt the flow. So I've just, I'll leave that one there. And then to get world-class training, we're linking in deep and also visit our site or the complete entrepreneur blog. So I wanted to squeeze in a link through to another one of my websites um, to just share that love, share the benefit of all of those links. So that's that. Now I'm just going to hit save and continue. And once we go through here, then we go through the distribution things. We'll leave the distribution to go out uh, as it's predefined it here, which is pretty much just ASAP. Um, it's They said sending it out at 12 a.m. Now I'm going to change that and I might send it out at just after sort of open for business. Actually, we'll send it at 10 a.m. Um, we'll send it Australia time. Now what I've done here as well, um, I've gone through and ticked all of the different things that I could find as relevant under what industries and um, I've got one more to target here so let's just see where I could uh, pop it in. Um, I'm going to have a look at maybe not that one, kind of want to have it under maybe news and talk shows. Look, I'm stretching a little bit here, but we get 10, so we might as well use all of them. Um, now, is there anything else under businesses? Small business, since it's related to SEO and that's the type of people we want, so I'll leave that. Uh, what regions? Now, I've specifically weighted over in uh, the California region and Silicon Valley and things like that 
uh, thinking that this is most likely going to be targeted to um, people in the tech industry. So, and I've also thought New York because New York's pretty big and a bit of a hub. Um, I've selected the West for that reason and also under information technology. Um, I haven't worried about the RSS feed and sharing on Twitter. I'm going to do that manually anyway. So once that's done, we'll hit submit release. Now that goes through, uh, the payment's all been confirmed and the next step is to hopefully get it approved and then once it's ready to go, we'll get posted out. Anyway, that's how you post a press release with PR Web. I might make a part two to this video uh, so we can check back and see once it's live what sort of success we're getting. Thanks.